Hi, this is Karen from Fashion Mission, and today I'm going to show you how to embellish your own pair of jeans. I'm Lindsay Calla, codename Saucy Glossy. I'm Karen Blanchard, codename Karen Britchick. This is Fashion Mission. I saw these on the runway, Isabel Moran sort of flag shipped doing these and they were amazing when she did them. And I thought, I need to do those jeans. And so I found a way to do it without needing any sewing. I can't stand sewing, so this is really easy. So first you obviously need a pair of jeans. I found these black cropped skinny jeans from Ernest Sewn and I thought they were just the right shape. And they're cropped, like I said, which is exactly what you need for this look. Next thing you're gonna need is the actual trimming. I found this fantastic trimming from M&J Trimming Store. Any trimming store would be great. I thought this is perfect. This is the one I'm wearing right now. I like that it's sort of like an off-white. It looks really stunning against the black. Found these cute, adorable butterflies. I have them as well on me. You can see on the jeans on either side of the hip. So it's just like a nice little accent piece to have. You're going to need a pair of scissors, obviously to cut the trimming, and a few safety pins just to place the trimming on the jean. Teflon sheet, so you can actually act as an adhesive between the iron and the fabric and a tape measure just to make sure that everything is even. All right, so taking the jeans, just lay them out on a flat surface. And now you're gonna actually start pinning the trimming to the jean. I start with the butterfly, first of all, because it just gives me an idea of spacing. Now it's important that you do it at an angle, as you can see, and just taking a safety pin, it's just to hold the place. Okay, so taking that first piece of trimming that I just cut, we just want to place it close to the butterfly, not on top of it, just about here, I'd say. And then you just want to pin it. So taking your hand inside, just pin it somewhere. This is quite a big pin, isn't it? And then you're just going to repeat on the other end. So now you've got to do the ironing part. This is what's going to actually get make it stick to the jean. So I'm just going to remove carefully one of the pins because you don't want to iron with this on. Take that off. Taking a Teflon sheet, they're reusable as well. I'm going to use one piece going up the whole leg, watch. So you lay on top of the trimming, then taking your iron, make sure there's steam on it. Some steam out and then you just lay this on top like that. For a pair of jeans, you're going to need mm, about a yard and a half-ish. The way I'm doing it is I'm not going all the way down the leg to the ankle. So if you want to, then get a couple of yards and then you're going to probably have extra. But that's fine because you could always use the little pieces to use for maybe the back of the jeans, the pockets. And don't forget, keep trying the jeans on just to make sure everything looks exactly the way you want it before you iron. So you can pin everything, actually, the whole lot, one leg, and put it all on and then see, mm, that looks good or not, and adjust. So let's check. Look at that, it's, it's, yep, yeah, it's stuck. It's like magic. So you move this up, just slide that pin out, and there you go with the steam. So now you're just gonna do the actual little butterfly, and you wanna keep it angled. And just put that little bit of sheet on and iron it down. So that's perfect, that stayed on. Now I just want to do this part here, as you can see that I've got, that goes up. So I'm not going to actually pin that part because it's so small. I think it will be fine. And just repeat the process, lay it down. That's it. Oh, it looks kind of cool, I like it. Ta-da! <laughs> you could try it leaving it one half, but no, I don't think I would do that. All right, so one leg is done, so you just need to repeat on the other side and just make sure that it's even. Okay, so I think that's enough, and it's done! I love it. Oh, I love how the butterflies really stand out. Ta-da! <laughs> I'm really, really pleased with these. Like I said before, this is just such an easy way to get the look that's on the runway for obviously a fraction of the price. And don't forget, you can use anything you want. So let me know what you come up with. Just leave a message in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to the Hello Style channel. This is Karen from Fashion Mission. I'll see you next time.